All right, we're inside Penny's, feeling much better, warm enough to get started. I'm caffeinated. You're caffeinated already. I'm feeling good. Excellent. I'm feeling good. So we're about an hour outside Hutchinson, which is where you grew up, which means you get to play in front of hometown fans, family. What's that like? It's been fun being able to win championships here and being from here. Everybody knows the drought of championships that we've had and all of our all of our sports except for us and the Twins. It's cool to be a part of that, and it's fun to do it at home. We marvel from afar at, at you guys packing the stadium you know, Prince being a fan, you've got players from the Wolves showing up. What is it about Minneapolis, you think, that has allowed them to get on board beyond the fact that obviously everyone loves a winning team? I think our team does it the right way. We try to give back as much as we can. We're out in the schools, we're in the community, and I feel like we're genuinely pretty good people. We're pretty tough on the court, but we, we want to be role models and all those things. Can you even reflect back on what it was like being a kid, the idea if you told yourself then that you'd be playing for a professional team, winning multiple titles in your hometown? No, because I, I, I grew up playing hockey, so hockey was my first sport. I played that till I was in sixth grade. And then I switched to basketball because there wasn't girls varsity hockey. Ninth grade, they started the WNBA, and I think when I was in 11th grade, we got the link. So no, growing up, you didn't think of that because it just wasn't an opportunity. What's it like to have all of these people descend upon Minneapolis for the Super Bowl? Have you seen a lot of you know, preparations taking place? They've been working on this for I don't know how many years, having the Super Bowl here. They've got the ice sculptures and the Nicollet Mall area is like completely blocked off and doing ice fishing on top of their rooftop nice. in downtown. So yeah, that was cool. If you how, Wait, how do you ice fish from a rooftop? Yeah, so they... Um, it's a very long I don't hole. know what they... <laughs> they just had like the two holes where you'd put your uh, reel in and tried to catch fish. They had like 40 fish down there, but we didn't get any bites. But no. It was pretty cool. Maybe so the fish knew something was up since they were on a rooftop. Yeah, on a rooftop in downtown. <laughs> they were like, weren't. Yeah, they right. were, yeah, I know. It was, it was interesting, but uh, it's been fun to be a Minnesotan, be a part of it, and we're excited for right. the game. All right, now that we're caffeinated, I think it's time to go get some grub. Sounds great. I know just the spot.